Finally, this one has been trending all weekend. A story from meteorologist Ben Gelber about an astronomical event that has never happened before. Next Tuesday, November 8th, will be the first total lunar eclipse on Election Day in U.S. history. The total lunar eclipse will be visible for a few hours before daybreak, low in the western sky, weather permitting, of course. The celestial event occurs when the Earth is between the sun and the moon, blocking out sunlight from reaching the lunar surface, which is instead covered by the Earth's shadow. Shadow. Pretty spooky, Brad. That can't be good that it's happening a full eclipse on election day. NASA captured this image of what looks like a smiley face on the sun. You see that there? NASA says this could be a warning sign. Oh, really? A warning sign? Hey, of what, Ash? Well, it's, uh, NASA says the image of that sun in ultraviolet light featuring those three dark patches that look like a smiling face could signal a solar storm which could present problems for Earth. Geomagnetic storms can disrupt GPS and create harmful currents in the power grid and the pipelines. No laughing matter, no smiling. It does look like a jack o' It does right look now. like a jack o' lantern. I'm a little suspicious of the timing, but. <laughs> right, exactly. All right, this image here may seem beautiful, right? But astronomers say it is absolutely terrifying. That brightly lit object is called a planet killer. It's a massive asteroid orbiting near Earth. It's more than a mile wide and until now had been undetected. One scientist says an asteroid that big hitting Earth would, quote, be a mass extinction event not seen on Earth in millions of years. Scientists say it would not happen for centuries, if at all. Astronomers expect to find more planet killing asteroids over the next couple of years. Right now, none is on a collision with co uh, collision course with Earth. Earlier this week, scientists announced a mile-wide asteroid was discovered in the inner solar system flying within the orbits of Earth and Venus. Now, if you're curious as to how something a mile wide flying through space that's been dubbed a planet killer could go undetected until this week, well, I think it is fair to say that you are not alone. Researchers say they have found a potentially life-threatening asteroid hiding in the glare of the sun. A team of international astronomers have discovered three new near-Earth asteroids. Two have orbits that won't intersect with Earth's, but a third, a one and a half kilometer wide chunk of space rock, could someday cross our path. This comes just weeks after NASA deliberately crashed a probe into an asteroid, the first full-scale test of asteroid deflection technology 